There's no way the hands are anywhere around here, right? Like, where would they be? I'd be fighting on such a weird incline. I also don't know if the hands are, are randomly encountered or if they're a set thing, you know? Hmm. Okay. Well, maybe they're... Maybe the hands aren't meant to be here. Oh, you know what? I need to... Hold on. Look at that! Look at that! How far does that go? Pretty, pretty far. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to be really careful here because... Even art. There's a lot. Oh, I'm right next to it. Okay. I am right next to it. Well, let's be quick. It's gonna be a massive drain of my resources. Man, this one's big. But there's a chest, and that makes it worth it. Gonna drain all of my good stuff. Uh, cold weather attack, probably not terribly important, especially right now. Uh, let's go up here. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Go up. Oh, it's, the souls are right next to the chest. That's cool. It gives me a chance to look around, too. Uh, it's gonna reset my timer. Grab these souls. Get the Zoni and move on. Get away. Get away from the lava. Get away from the lava. I am almost dead. Whew. All right. What is this tower going to lead to is my question. Like, what could it it reasonably lead to that I haven't already explored? Because I've explored the surface. That's not a problem. Um, I think I've probably explored everything. The only, the only real question is, um, will it... Will it give me warp me into a place that I, I've never been that might not be accessible from the surface because like that's really the big question here what does the map look like straight above me we've been there I don't need to go up there unless I mean in the comments tell me and I can I can easily warp back but I don't need to I don't need to warp up there I also should sw switch my map I'm gonna fly through the fire and the flames. I can fly straight through that, though. Oh, and I could get to that, and then get a new plane. For cheap. <gasps> Ooh, what's down there? Is that a stone talus? That's multiple. Ah, it's a stone talus followed by a big boss. Okay. Oh, there he is. There he is in all of his beauty. Let's crash this. Hi, Stone Talus. I probably should have had the height advantage against you, but I really... I'm not threatened too much by co Stone Taluses, in case it wasn't in, in exceedingly, exceedingly obvious. Uh, yeah, this. Boom. That missed. You know what I could do? Start wiggling. Oh, okay. Fine. <laughs> that hurt a lot. <laughs> Fine. That's fair. I'll just kill you now. One more. Okay. <laughs> I, I paid the price for goofing off there. I almost died, actually. Ooh, a diamond? Some charges. We'll get the updraft. I'm just trying to lo think logistically here. That doesn't mean I aggro him, right? Okay, we're good. I'm probably not going to get take damage from him, and I don't think the damage is blight, but I'll at least heal a little bit. And I can meet him in the air. Another Colgara. Let's go. Let's equip for the part. I don't need attack up, but I do need defense. Which I have with this. Okay, cool. Come on. There we go. He'll freeze and... Oh, yeah. I, I've never attacked him from above. I think it's time I actually do that. Can I get him from up? from below. He thinks. Come on. 
One more. Boom. Nice. Snaked it through. Let's not get hit. He's going to the portal. He's going to come in from beneath. I'm an expert at this fight now. I'm proficient. I chose the right side. Sweet. Next phase. I'm in free fall. Mash X. Mash X. I don't like that I started free fall there. Do I die to the... The, the game's not going to do that to me. This isn't Super Mario Sunshine. It's going to cut scene me higher, probably. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Okay. Good job, game. Dodge! Oh, it put, spawns me so close to the... That's a lot of souls. I do have that marked. Cool. I guess they're just really big. It's not actually spawning me that close to them. Whoa! Okay. Just gonna summon them again. I just need to find my in here. They're getting really close. Whoa! I am glad I got, haven't gotten hit by those until now. That's a lot of them. That's a solid wall. I tried to dive beneath them. Okay, I can get above. Whew. That's a lot of damage. That just instantly killed me um, from almost full health. I don't think I had full, full health. Uh, let's, get, let's get this going because I think that'll probably be enough to protect me from getting instantly popped by that. That is the first time he's hit me, and what a hit it was. Okay, he doesn't lead his shots very well. Let's... Oh, he, that, that hole's empty. I forgot. I was going to say I can attack it. Oh, wait, it's not. It's not. Because he respawned it. Yeah. There's one. Oh! I don't want to know what happens if I, I land on top of those spikes. Get ready, Tulin. We're gonna have to pick a side. It's gonna have to be real quick. I'm still not super familiar with which side is optimal. Got it. Not optimal, but like how to react to that properly. All right, come on. Next, next one, next one, next one. Boom. Is that it? Not quite. One more shot. Whoa, my bow broke. Get a new one. There it is. GG. GG. That was a... That was a lot of damage. But ultimately, an easy fight. It's a pretty easy fight. One hit. We've gotten hit once between three Colgeras. I'm also surprised by the amount of Colgeras that we've encountered. Like, oh. Uh, I think isn't that good. I have that. That kind of sucks, man. Uh, well... We'll get rid of this. Yeah, uh, the Gibdo Queen. We only encountered one of them in the depths, I believe. Right? Um, oh, we might have encountered two, because I, I tried to kill one with the lemons, and I, I have a feeling I probably clowned on, like, the second one we saw. All right. Where am I? I'm going this way. Told you I'd get turned around. Um, it's up there, or is it down? It's definitely not down. Oh yeah, the souls. I should probably, should probably grab those. My ultimate goal this session is to finish and clear out the entirety of the Hebrew Depths this session, which I'm quickly realizing is a gargantuan task and probably not feasible. I'm at like the two, two and a half hour mark. Granted, there was a solid half an hour of me just, you know, warming up because I tried to do that. Uh, but, ugh. At the rate I'm going, I'm gonna get like half of it done this session. There we go. And there's more lava. At this point though, I'm not above returning to the surface just to cook. Um, the adventure part of this series, I'm not saying is over, but like we are so much more than we were when we started. And um, I don't know, it just, I think it makes sense in terms of abilities to be like, yeah, yeah, I'm fine leaving. We can, we can leave. Uh, frocks? Frocks? I 
think I see the pile of zone. There he is. That's a white one. Is that a... Oh, no. Is this a silver? Is this... I also haven't taken pic a picture of a Colgara. Blue-white. Okay. I think that is harder than the last one we fought. Okay, we have... Old pictures much better. Boss fight after boss fight. Draining our resources slowly but very surely. Uh, before I do this, hold on. I wonder if that gives off light. It kind of looks like it might. Okay. We're gonna equip this. When he jumps, I'm flying. And that's actually gonna be really good for me. Oh, wait, I should probably... Not until I want to. I could also just steal his stuff and leave. <sighs> Sup, buddy? I shot that! I got that shot! Let's go! Alright, let's start this off with a bang! Uh, yeah, attack up. Uh, attack. Where's the other stuff? Attack up. And. That's good damage. Now this one. Wait for it, wait for it. Got it. I got the height. Sweet. What are you doing? Now what are you doing? Opening your mouth for me. Goofy bean. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Blow up. There we go. Let's make sure that I kill him right now. And by... That's not the button I want. I'm trying to claw, and it's not working out for me. There we go. That's not good. Uh, don't be greedy. Don't be greedy. Don't be greedy. Don't be greedy. Nice. I think I just kill him with, uh, with my bow from here. Let's get... You know what? Let's stop. Let's let's drop our over reliance on multi shot bows, and maybe use a couple pagibdo bones. Shoot you, or I just bomb him. I'm just gonna bomb him. Wait for it. Wait for it. I'm a little bit too low to the ground to land on him after he blows up. Or be yeah, there we go. So I just I'll just walk up. Um, I like this. There's one. And there's two. That was a very casually competent Frox fight. A walk in the park, one might even say. Been a long time since we saw one of those. Okay, ready. Here we go. Drop a little bit. Where's the chest? Where's the chest? Okay, there's some stuff I want. I didn't heal myself on purpose because... Oh, snap. I made that mistake. Oh, I didn't think of that. Uh, sucks that I have to do this, but I do. Okay. Very awkward. Okay, I need to go this way. This really sucks. I do not have the gear to handle this. Uh, I just have to churn through resources. There's the chest. Okay. There's the chest and there's a bunch of Zonite. The Zonite I do actually think is worth it. Ready, set, and... Actually, I don't have Tulin yet. Now I do. And this is how I'm going to do it. I know this looks weird that I'm leaving... I'm ignoring one of these, but trust me, trust me as I pause time 
to scarf down more mushrooms. Welcome to Skyrim. Reason why is because this refreshes my timer. The cap of time! We now have the leggings and the cap. What a great reward. We might get the full set before we're done with this. Yeah, the chest refreshes my timer, which allows me to go back here, which is near the edge of this whole thing. Ooh. <laughs> I'm fine. I'm okay. I'm okay. And fly away. There we go. It was calculated. It was about mitigation. Well, now that I have no resources left, <laughs> I'm going to teleport to the... No, I'm joking. I'm not going to teleport just yet. Uh, Let's see. Only six for my crazy thing? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. 